Hi, my name is Daniel Nellis. Today's song is a Come All You Faithful, We Adore You by Paul Balash. It's a fun song. It's a 6-8. It's a, it's a kind of big rambunctious song. So there's lots of cool moving parts. I like some of the uh, kind of the riffs that the player played in there. I'm, I'm actually going to teach you this whole lesson. But on YouTube here, you can just see a portion of the lesson. If you like what you see, click on the bottom right hand corner. There's a Worship Artistry logo there. It'll take you over to our full site where this whole lesson is there with the loops to practice along to as well as all the cool little bits and pieces. You can sign up for a free account. There's you know, there's tabs there, there's lessons for bass, drums, guitar, and piano, and we've got a green room to hang out in. It's a fun place to be. I like to see you over there, but in the meantime, enjoy the lesson right here for free on YouTube. The song is in the key of G, and we're going to start on the high G, which is on the fifth fret on the D string, right over there. It's an eight bar intro. We're going to come in right at the top with the drums, so make sure that you actually are watching your drummer. Make sure that he's kind of counts you off. One, two, three, four, five, six. Bam, you come in together for that eight bar intro. The first four bars are big kind of solid notes. You play one for two bars. You play another note for another two bars. And then you start your groove, which is one and two and three, four, five, six, one and two and. So it's on the end of two. Uh, that's going to be the groove for the bulk of the song. Verse two has got a little bit of a different groove, but we're going to start right over here on the G. One, two, three, four, five, six, two, two, three. And again, two, three, four, five, six, two. Now we're going to slide up, playing the groove, and slide up again. Four, five, six, four, five, six. That's the whole intro. Practice that with a loop below. When I slide up to those, uh, that G, I'm actually sliding on the A string, and when I get to the G, I'm hitting it, so it's Alright, practice that with the loop below and I'll catch you in this verse. 